Jupiter is a planet of staggering proportions. Its massive size and swirling clouds of gas make it a giant among giants, a true behemoth in the cosmic arena. It reigns supreme in our solar system, boasting a family of 79 known moons. These moons range from tiny, irregularly shaped rocks to large, spherical bodies that could almost be considered planets in their own right. This astonishing number surpasses any other planet. No other celestial body in our solar system can claim such a vast and diverse collection of natural satellites. Imagine gazing up at a night sky filled with dozens of moons, each one reflecting the sunlight in its own unique way, creating a celestial dance that would be a breathtaking sight to behold. This is the reality for Jupiter. Its moons are a testament to the planet's gravitational might and its ability to capture and hold on to these celestial companions. Jupiter's immense size and powerful gravitational pull are key to understanding its lunar abundance. This gravitational force is so strong that it can influence objects millions of miles away, drawing them into its orbit. As the largest planet in our solar system, Jupiter's influence extends far and wide. Its presence is felt across the vast expanse of space, affecting not just its moons, but also the orbits of other planets and asteroids. Its gravitational domain captures and holds onto a vast collection of celestial objects, including its many moons. These moons are a diverse group, each with its own unique characteristics and histories. These moons are not just passive bystanders. They are dynamic worlds, each with its own geological activity, atmospheres, and even potential for hosting life. They are active worlds, with their own stories to tell. From volcanic eruptions on Io to the icy crust of Europa, each moon presents a unique environment that scientists are eager to explore. Their unique features and compositions provide valuable insights into the formation and evolution of our solar system. By studying these moons, we can learn more about the processes that shaped not only Jupiter, but also the Earth and other planets. Space missions like Galileo and Juno have provided us with detailed data about these moons, revealing their complex surfaces and intriguing potential for future exploration. Future missions are already being planned to delve even deeper into the mysteries of Jupiter's moons. These missions aim to uncover more about their potential for life and their role in the broader context of our solar system. Jupiter's lunar abundance is not just a fascinating aspect of our solar system, it is a window into the past and a key to understanding the future. Each moon is a piece of the puzzle, helping us to unravel the story of our cosmic neighborhood. Where did Jupiter's moons come from? The answer lies in the early solar system. Billions of years ago, a swirling disk of gas and dust surrounded our newborn sun. This disk, called a protoplanetary disk, was the birthplace of planets and their moons. Within this disk, Jupiter formed as a giant planet. Its immense gravity attracted surrounding gas and dust. This material swirled around Jupiter, forming a circumplanetary disk. Over time, particles within this disk collided and stuck together. These clumps grew larger, eventually forming the moons we see today. Jupiter's massive size gives it an enormous gravitational pull. This powerful force is a key factor in the planet's impressive moon count. Jupiter's gravity acts like a cosmic vacuum cleaner, attracting and capturing passing objects. Asteroids, comets, and even other smaller moons can become ensnared by Jupiter's gravitational pull. Once trapped, these objects become part of Jupiter's moon system. This process of capturing moons is ongoing, contributing to the ever-growing number of moons orbiting Jupiter. Jupiter's moons are not a uniform bunch. They display a remarkable diversity in size, composition, and orbital characteristics. Some moons are giant, rocky worlds, while others are small, icy bodies. Some moons orbit Jupiter in a regular, circular pattern. Others follow more eccentric, elongated orbits. This diversity is a testament to the dynamic processes that shaped Jupiter's moon system. Studying this diversity provides valuable clues about the formation and evolution of planetary systems, including our own. The Galilean Giants Among Jupiter's 79 moons, four stand out as true giants, Io, Europa, Ganymede, and Callisto. These four moons, known as the Galilean moons, were discovered by Galileo Galilei in 1610. They are among the largest moons in our solar system. Ganymede, the largest of the four, is even bigger than the planet Mercury. These moons are easily visible with even a small telescope and offer a breathtaking sight for stargazers. 
Each of these moons possesses unique characteristics that make them fascinating targets for scientific exploration. Iowa, a volcanic inferno. Io is the most volcanically active body in our solar system. Its surface is a chaotic landscape of volcanoes, lava flows, and sulfur plumes. The intense volcanic activity is driven by tidal heating. Jupiter's powerful gravity stretches and compresses Io, generating immense heat within the moon's interior. This heat fuels the spectacular volcanic eruptions. Io's volcanism has a significant impact on the surrounding environment contributing to Jupiter's magnetosphere and creating a torus of plasma around the planet. Europa, an ocean world? Europa is a moon shrouded in mystery and intrigue. This small moon, orbiting the giant planet Jupiter, has captivated scientists and astronomers for decades. Its surface is a frozen expanse of ice, but what lies beneath is even more fascinating. Beneath its icy surface, scientists believe lies a vast salty ocean. This ocean is thought to be kept liquid by the heat generated from tidal flexing, a process caused by the gravitational pull of Jupiter. The ice crust is estimated to be several kilometers thick, but beneath it, the ocean could be as deep as 100 kilometers. This ocean, potentially containing more water than all of Earth's oceans combined, is a prime candidate for extraterrestrial life. The sheer volume of water increases the chances of finding life, as water is a crucial ingredient for life as we know it. The ocean's salty composition also suggests that it might have the necessary chemical ingredients to support life. The presence of water, along with potential sources of energy and chemical building blocks, makes Europa one of the most promising places in our solar system to search for life beyond Earth. Scientists are particularly interested in the potential hydrothermal vents on the ocean floor, similar to those found in Earth's oceans, which could provide the energy needed for life to thrive. Future missions to Europa will aim to confirm the existence of this ocean and search for signs of life. These missions will involve sophisticated instruments designed to penetrate the ice and analyze the water below. The Europa Clipper mission, set to launch in the coming years, will conduct detailed reconnaissance of Europa's ice shell and subsurface ocean. By studying Europa, we hope to answer one of humanity's most profound questions. Are we alone in the universe? Ganymede and Callisto Ancient Surfaces Ganymede and Callisto are two of the oldest objects in our solar system. Their surfaces are heavily cratered, bearing witness to billions of years of impacts from asteroids and comets. Ganymede, the largest moon in our solar system, is the only moon known to have its own magnetic field. This field creates auroras, similar to the northern lights on Earth. Callisto, on the other hand, has a dark, ancient surface that is thought to be one of the least geologically active in the solar system. Cosmic Significance Jupiter's moons are not just celestial curiosities, they are dynamic worlds, each with its own story to tell. From the volcanic activity on Io to the icy crust of Europa, these moons offer a glimpse into the diverse processes that occur in our solar system. They are valuable laboratories for understanding the formation and evolution of planetary systems. By examining the geological and atmospheric conditions of these moons, scientists can draw parallels and contrasts with Earth and other planets, enriching our knowledge of planetary science. By studying these moons, we gain insights into the processes that shaped our own solar system and the potential for life beyond Earth. The presence of subsurface oceans on moons like Europa and Ganymede raises intriguing possibilities about the existence of microbial life in environments vastly different from our own. The diversity of Jupiter's moons, their unique characteristics, and their potential for harboring life make them compelling targets for future exploration. Each moon presents a unique set of conditions and challenges, from the intense radiation belts around Io to the thick ice layers of Europa, and their potential for harboring life make them compelling targets for future exploration. Missions like the upcoming Europa Clipper and the JUICE mission aim to delve deeper into these mysteries, using advanced technology to probe beneath the surfaces and gather data that could revolutionize our understanding of these distant worlds. As we continue to explore our cosmic neighborhood, the technological advancements in space exploration will enable us to reach farther and study these moons in unprecedented detail. 
The data collected from these missions will not only enhance our understanding of Jupiter's moons, but also provide critical insights into the broader mechanisms at play in the universe. Jupiter's moons will undoubtedly hold many more surprises and discoveries in store. The ongoing research and future missions promise to uncover secrets that could answer fundamental questions about the origins of life and the conditions necessary for its existence. What secrets do these distant worlds hold? The varied landscapes and geological features of these moons hint at complex histories and dynamic processes that we are only beginning to understand. The answers await us in the depths of space. As we push the boundaries of exploration, each discovery brings us closer to unraveling the mysteries of our solar system and beyond, inspiring future generations to continue the quest for knowledge.